when it has been years since anyone's heard anything but static and white noise on the radio. Who could still believe we are not alone on this earth? My wife, my comrades from the Order, my friends, people from my station. Nobody believes me. They are sure that there's nothing on the radio. Sure that save for us who hid in Moscow Metro, there were no survivors of the last war. We are alone on this planet, and in the Metro it's common knowledge. But I did hear that call on the radio with my own ears. Yes, it was immediately drawn out by the static. But I had heard it. Which means that somewhere out there, under the skies, there's still a habitable place. We're not doomed to live the rest of our lives underground. Still, nobody believes me. Where to now? Left across the square. Hey, Damir, do you think the colonel knows what Artyom been up to here? How am I supposed to know? Ask him yourself. He radioed from the rig, said he'd be here tomorrow. Hey, you, leave him alone. I killed him myself that. with my slingshot. <laughs> Let him learn to stand up for himself. How else can he hope to survive in the metro? Rise and shine, people. Hang in there, Artyom. You're gonna get a fresh dose of Spartan blood now. Artyom, are you awake? It's okay. The doctor said you'll be fine. Are you trying to kill me with worry? What if next time you don't return from the surface? There's no one out there, Artyom. No one to find, no one to talk to. If there was, don't you think they'd be here already? We've talked about this again and again. You have to accept it. There's only us. Colonel! Hello, Alex. There you are, you stubborn fool. 
how many times are we going to have this conversation? I don't care if you kill yourself over this silly dream of yours. But don't you see what you're doing to my daughter? Your wife? Dad, please. The order is short on men after the battle for D6. But you leave. People need you. And you pursue your selfish obsession. But now this shit has to stop. There's only Metro, nothing else. And the Order is here to defend it. Because if not us, then who? You look fine to me. So get ready to go. Then we'll discuss your transfer to police. Come, we need to talk. I'll get the doctor. Artyom? Please, promise me this was the last time. I'll see you later. Artyom, we managed to bring you back from the brink, but people are giving you their blood, which could save so many wounded, and you keep bringing it back irradiated. Don't you think that is unfair? Let me put it this way. I can't promise I'll be able to bring you back next time. doing that. Well, not everyone can stand being cooped up down here. But why not? It's what's kept us alive up to now. Huh. <laughs> and how long do you think that's going to last? How many kids are there on the station? In all you must come back to the last here in ten years. Oh, I can't believe my eyes. Artyom, you're all right. You gave us a scare, brother. Artyom, how are you, friend? I see you're all right. This calls for a celebration. A few more scars and you will be completely irresistible to any woman. Speaking of which... Alos, you are the nurse's You just stop crowding him. Brother, Brother. Back up, Joe. Ah, ah, Alright, you. right. you're all dismissed. I give you two hours, people. Yeah! yeah. <laughs> oh, it's yeah. official. Yeah. I knew it. You guys are like so kids. I brought something. And here we go again. <laughs> Please, let's not repeat the last Hold time. Hold on, Artyom. The only thing I can hear is that Geiger counter ticking. <sighs> Why, yes, and there's also those damn things. Calling all the time. Let's go home, dear, please. Don't you think I'd also love to live on an ocean beach or in a green forest? But what good are these fantasies in a silent world? Silent, Artyom? Because it's dead. We took our time. Time to replace our filters. Come on, replace your filter. Haven't you spent enough time in the sick bay? All right, let's get moving. Oh, father will kill me if he finds out I went up with you. Twice if he learns we've been to a Hansa off-limit zone. Have you been to all these ruins? 
see all the destruction. And Moscow had the best anti-air defense in the country. If this is how it looks now, imagine how the rest of the world looks. back to the order. We'll move to Polis. Dad says he'll arrange a flat for us. Because if not us, then who? A flat with a kitchen and a shower. Let's go in turns here. It's not stable enough. Your turn now. Well, I'd say we're out of the woods. Whoa! Hear that? Turn the night off. Did you hear that? all of them. I'm glad they didn't notice us. That was a large pack. Oh, is this why the zone is off limits? I mean, if all the packs here are like that. We take the bridge to cross the railroad. It would save us a detour. Damn, too high. Hey, Hatyam, help me get out there. Go! 
You should have checked first, assholes! Artyom, thank God. These people, they're Hansa, not the Order. Assholes. Oh, they did a number on you. Well, Dad will rip them a new one Look, for what's that. What's going on in this Moscow of yours, anyways? Of yours? You're putting this like you're not from here. We aren't. Our village is about 200 kilometers from here. What village? You're not from Moscow? Just a regular village. We came here to find the boy's father. Left for Moscow about a year ago and never came back. But then we got caught by this here. You mean there's life outside? Why wouldn't there be any? Sure, there are lots of bad places and lots of beasts around, but we still get by. Artyom, you were right. People really do live out there. We didn't know. We thought we were the only survivors. God, we'll tell the whole Metro about this. The heck and the boy out! Hey, you people drove us halfway to nowhere. They can handle it. At least give them their masks back.
him. Watchmen broke through. Workers are done for. Two have been trained on the opening. If anything comes through, shoot. Huh? What's that noise? Attention! The turntable is switching on. For the ravine if you don't shut up. Now listen, if you come out of here, we won't accept this shit again. Okay? Animals. How can they? What can I do? The mutant? The watchman! Human! How did you... Oh, oh my god! It's you she's been screaming about! Alive! You came for her! All right. I'll help. Finally. I'll be of some use. Okay, they took the girl to the base chief for interrogation. I can't take you to the main entrance, too many guards, but we may sneak in from the back. Let's go. Don't rush, though. If they notice you, we're both done for. Wait. You'd better not walk into the light. Let's do it this way. You sneak to the lighting panel and disable it while I distract them. Sneaking to it now. Stay close to the wall. Yermak, is that you? What are you mumbling? Come here and help me fix this. Yes, sir. Got me over me. Come on, come on. Fixing this should be nothing for you. Take him down. Can you do it quietly? What is that mumbling? Ah, your Mac. Time to fit that pine jacket, huh? Yeah. Throw it! 
I hope the noise distracts him. Well done. Is this yours? They just left it sitting there. We must get out before they recover. Get ready, people. Guards! You have to go sneak through the courtyard. Take the door the guards are coming through. Here, quick! Let's go! Who are you? Andrei Ivanovich Yermak, the train engineer. Run now! Just get to that hangar, then go to it. So I get there easily. Why are you helping us, Andrei Ivanovich? I had. Uh, uh, I guess I'll tell you later. I hope. Uh, hey guys, be careful. What's going on? Hey. Hey. Artyom, I see the enemy. Give me a boost. Can't really see well with the snowstorm. Don't forget your visibility gauge, Atyom. If you don't move too fast and don't come out into the light, you'll be harder for them to notice. Don't turn your flashlight on either, they could notice. Atyom, incoming two of them. I'll give you some cover from above. Shut 
brought them in and scoot it. Oh, yeah. Agent Egg reporting. Metro leader pretended to be civilians. You rookies all think you know everything after a week of service. Yeah. Something down there. Oh, no! I see him there. It's on, covering you. Civilians aren't allowed to just walk around now. 
Great, and you finally get a chance to relax like this. Huh? All clear. Am I glad to see you here? Are you all right? I'm fine, thank you. All right. We don't have much time. They'll be back. I'll go to the engine. It should be ready now. You go up there and Come switch on, the Tiam. turntable mechanism on.
to our compasses. Over. Roger that, base. Over. All right, shoot these two. And as for the engineer... Ooh, what do you mean, shoot these two? Is Don't the you dare right give me a limb, soldier. Here. The colonel will give you a piece of his mind now. Colonel, sir, we have a situation here. Anna! Dad! Guys! It's us! Help us! What the hell? Artur! What are you doing here? Talk about Sir Colonel, Christ. this will mean court-martial for all of you. All right, everyone, shut up! I can't believe this. Just can't believe Shit! So this is true? You are working for them? The bastards shot Artyom! Be quiet! Be How did you end up here? Ah, it doesn't matter. You have no idea what you just stuck your heads in. We've no moves left. Hansa can't take this line now. Oh, the watchers Sherlock. won't let No, them. I won't be quiet. What is this jammer for? Why are they hiding the fact that Moscow didn't survive alone? There, in the ravine, there are people from other cities, dead, all of them, women, up. children. I'll tell you all later. Gramps, what's going on out there? Down this road. The road is fine, at least until a hundred click mark. Is there a safe place to stop nearby? Of course. We have to make haste, though. They got the cruiser. All right, gentlemen. Artyom and Anna have just made a huge mess, and I can't go back to Moscow now. The wartime legislation dictates they'd be killed. In any case, I have to get them out of town until it all blows over. But you all should stay. Hear me, Major? My people are in no way related to not my this call, and you know misunderstanding. Well, I'll jam. fight for the guys no matter what. Of course, Artyom, Anna, they are the with us. The order leaves no one behind. It's it's not us. Us. Who? Who? All right, Spartans, throw these overboard and full steam ahead. Come with me, Artyom. Let's catch them there. I'm so glad the boys supported us. It looks like my father didn't say a word to them about this either. We spent 20 years in Metro, thinking the rest of the world was burnt to a crisp in the war. But they just circled Moscow with those jammers, and we were none the wiser. How perfect of them! While you were getting irradiated on the surface, my father just kept lying! Lying to you, to me, to everyone, the whole fucking world, and not even batting an eye! Desertion, treason, 
Are you fucking kidding me? Me? A traitor? You tell me, where are you taking that train, huh? On a simple joyride? No, I see only one answer. You've been fought and you're running back to your master. So the verdict has already been passed. We won't even see a trial. Cut that shit out. What are you carrying, man? Defense plans? You want to buy yourself a seaside retirement with a life, you damn cripple? Plans? Treason? We have served you people without question for years! We have spilled our blood for the cause! You sold out! They destroyed us and you! I have been a soldier my whole life! I have dedicated my life to my people, my country! But I'll be damned if I give it to parasites like you! not just traitors. We are honest-to-God enemy saboteurs. We stopped a hundred clicks from Moscow to check our Geiger counters. The thing is, they are all in the green, as if they're in a conspiracy. 
still this amazing piece of news doesn't really impress anyone that much. The guys are all confused as to what to do next. And I... I'm just waiting for answers. And hoping the commander, whom until recently I trusted implicitly, is going to be extremely persuasive in his reasoning. We are at a crossroads, so to speak, where everybody can help but wonder, what next? Where do we go from here? Hmm, yes. More or less what I expected from you. But you got the picture. So, is your counter functioning? Have you checked it? Yes, it's all green. Double checked it. Stepan's in the green too. We don't need masks here. So, they were telling the truth. Who was telling the truth? Why won't you answer? Who were those people trying to kill us? Why would they shoot at you, the Order's commander? Explain something, at least! You owe us that! Well, I might as well drop the bomb now. The war did not end. What do you uh, mean, what? did not end? Let me finish. Most of our cities are destroyed. The rest of the country is probably under enemy occupation. To avoid new nuclear attacks against us, Command chose the only viable course of action, to play dead. To ensure radio silence, the SHIELD system was created. A network of radio jammers covering Moscow and suburbs. So that some radio enthusiasts wouldn't bring more bombs down on our heads by whining on air. And it's one of these jammers that got disabled by the hands of those present here. Could you not have shared that before? Say, before Artyom took that radio outside and caught all that radiation? No! I only got briefed half a year ago. Under a strict, you talk, you die policy. And then had to tell my people we were securing a weather station. Sir, with all due respect, if we can't go back, maybe we should advance and move on? I have an idea, but... Uh... Artyom, rather than carrying on with this silent disapproval of yours, check the airwaves. We should be out of the jamming range by now, so give it your best try. Look for transmissions from the Ark. <sighs> Do you understand now why we are traitors in the eyes of command? We shut down a jamming station, shot up the guards, destroyed a patrol train, and ran away from Moscow. Who even needs a trial when the case is so clear? There's no way back now. Which means we have to continue moving forward. Command, what are you talking about? The Moscow Defense Command. Have you ever heard of the Invisible Watchers? I have, but they're just an urban legend. Not at all. They are command. Are you sure they care for more than just protecting their asses? You mentioned the Ark. What's that all about? If our team finds their signal, you'll figure everything out. Otherwise, there is nothing to talk about. Do you think finding that Ark of yours is going to fix everything? I do not. But if you have a better idea, then go ahead. Yes, I do. We have to find a good place for people from Moscow. Like Artyom always wanted! Giving them all to the enemy? A grand idea! I say, we solve our problems before moving on to saving all Moscow. Alright? How is it going, Artyom? Found it yet? There's a whole world out here! A world where we could live! 
So far, we only know one thing for sure. Radiation levels are normal. The air is breathable. But what about the rain? So what? You can't even breathe in Moscow. So? Does anybody live out here? We don't know. How will they treat us? I don't know that either. What would they do if they found out there are survivors in Moscow? Again, I don't know. Keep looking at them. It's got to be a signal. But we do know we've been lied to. For 20 years, we've been lied to. We know they've been killing people. Collateral damage is inevitable in operations of such scale and secrecy. Yes, people have died. But the bombs killed tens of millions. Yet we are alive. We stayed alive throughout those years. That's your own... Wait a moment, what was that? Area 18-5. I repeat, from me to the right... Listen, everyone! point location is code 1811-79. Area 18 5 Only by standing together shall we overcome any and all obstacles. Got it! So, it is somewhere around here. The Yamantau Mountain. So, the route from here should go... Uh, like this. This is our goal! So, is this what you had in mind? Yes! This is it! The Ark Project is a whole city underground. Enormous stores, machines, the best experts. It is the Commander General's HQ. All of the country's leaders are there. They have already started the restoration work! We will tell them that Moscow is alive! It wasn't all for nothing! Everything will change! Everything! Do you get it? A new life is starting for all the survivors of the world! Yeah. Yeah. By the way, are there any single women in that place? <laughs> Great reaction. So, I think the moment calls for... Hmm. Bring it out, Demir! Bring what out, Colonel? Sir! That thing that's been sloshing about in your canteen. <laughs> you think I'm deaf or what? Ah, uh, that. Uh, just a moment. I, I thought my ears were deceiving me. <laughs> <laughs> it's not a short trip to the Urals, so we should make ourselves comfortable, I guess. But let's name this bucket of bolts at the very least, eh? Huh? It's about time. Let's go around and be done with it. <laughs> nah, go to hell. <laughs> Even better. Oh, come How on. about Aurora, the Roman goddess of dawn and a cruiser of, uh, uh, you know what? That's better. <laughs> Not bad. I like it. Ah, beautiful name. Sounds okay, but the cruiser of what? Yeah, I'll tell you later. Looks like it's decided. <laughs> Let's drink to the Aurora! Hey, Artyom, let's take a look at that map. All right, we had a round. That should be enough. You're back. Full steam ahead. Hi. Full steam ahead. Wow, that's some yes. distance. I wonder how long it will take. How are you, Alyosha? So you know, scars attract the ladies. And there's definitely a lot of those up ahead. I don't need a lot, really. 